Hello and welcome to my channel. Before we talk about sleep hypnosis, please like and subscribe down below and leave a comment letting me know if you have ever tried sleep hypnosis yourself. So I have been practicing hypnosis for I want to say over a year now and mm, I practice it when I want to get a very deep rest. It's one of my favorite non-sleep deep rest practices and before I do that I use my vibrating platform just to like get the vibrations flowing and moving, move the lymphatic system before I start it. And I do it because I like to basically like reset my entire system. So this platform is super, super helpful. And I like doing that before my non-sleep deep rest practice. as a protocol to help me sleep a lot more deeply. Um, so I'll tell you about um, sleep hypnosis. Um, to find out if you can be easily hypnotized yourself, there's actually a pretty cool trick that you can tell um, that I learned from a neuroscientist um, in Stanford, California. And what you can do is you can close your eyes like ever so softly like this, and if they flicker, as you look up, like so, then you can tell that you can be very easily hypnotized. So again, you slowly close your eyes, and then look up, and if your eyes are flickering, and your, I mean your eyelids specific, more specifically, and if you can kind of see your eyelashes and your eyes flickering, then that means you can very, you will very, very much enjoy a sleep hypnosis practice. I myself, it's no secret that I have insomnia and I've been suffering for it, from it for many, many years. I would say like 20 years or so. And what has really helped me to sleep really deeply is to implement that protocol as part of my breath work meditation practice and non-sleep deep rest practice protocols. There are several kinds of non-sleep deep rest protocols, such as yoga nidra, breath work, meditation, um, Wim Hof practices. Um, and so this sleep hypnosis that I try is very, very simple to do. Um, In fact, actually, I recommend trying it out for yourself and see if you like it. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys have tried it before or if you struggle with insomnia and what kinds of things you do because that is what works for me and I am so open to trying lots of different things but this is what I usually like to start out with, the vibrating platform. Um, I use it so often, it really helps with my pain management. And then it furthers my non-sleep deep rest protocol practice. So as always, thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. If you'd like to learn more about insomnia, and reducing anxiety, how to treat insomnia. Let me know down below because I've got lots of tricks for you. Bye.